can you survive a boating disaster? Inside Edition producer Brianna Deutsch gets life-saving tips from the U.S. Coast Guard. Having the life jackets on board, that's a, it's a key requirement. Coast Guard officer Matt Vaughn tells us it's the law to have a life jacket for every person on board a boat. Children under the age of 13 are required to wear them at all times. If you're offshore, you should carry three nighttime flares and three daytime flares. You're going to see that from quite a distance. That's an internationally recognized distress signal. Other life-saving tool, a strobe light. When you're in the water, you want to have it up at the highest point of your person so that uh, whether it's an aircraft or a boat that comes by, they'd actually see it. Also, carry a whistle. The noise can alert others to your whereabouts. And a digital life-saving tool, a locating device called an EPIRB. That's an EPIRB. If the vessel was to capsize or sink, that will float free and it'll basically signal to a satellite your location. All great tips to help you survive a coastal emergency.